Well, hello everybody, this is Street Outlaws No Prep Talk. Today we're going to talk about Justin Sonstrom's impressive testing for Tulsa No Prep Kings. Now, photo credit goes directly to Justin Sonstrom. Please subscribe and comment and stay tuned for a lot more videos coming. All about the Street Outlaws No Prep Kings race series and all the other Street Outlaws shows. So, basically I was browsing through Facebook today and Justin actually made a post and a very interesting post because he has been testing prenup with its new engine combination and new color, obviously. And this car just went faster to the eighth mile than pretty much every twin turbo car on no prep kings. And that is impressive it being a screw blown car. This car just went today, this morning. 202.76 miles an hour. So basically 203 miles an hour. And that is faster, to put it into perspective, than Murder Nova that runs 201 or so. And it's a twin turbo car. And pretty much as fast as Jeff Lutz, which probably has the fastest mile an hour car right now on NPK. So 202 miles an hour, that is extremely fast. That's just the bottom line. And when you have a screw blown car that's 60 foot retarded fast, I mean, I'm guessing, I don't know, but I'm guessing they're running 960s to a 60 foot pretty easily, probably even faster, 950s. Screw blown cars are really, really fast to the 60 foot and to the 330s. So if I had to take a guess, they're running 960s to the 60 foot and T50s to the 330. And uh, with that back split, this thing should be running in the high 370s. Obviously, we don't know. And Justin, obviously, is not going to post those, those time slips. I wouldn't. But the fact that he posted a mile an hour, that makes a statement. Because this car is fast. They upgraded the engine and basically set up the motor to run a screw blower. Because they were previously running... The Procharge combination, or at least the Procharge setup on the Hemi with a screw blower. And things do change. Even though boost is boost, screw blowers like to be spun higher. And they up the compression on the motor, change the camshaft, change the crank. And I mean, basically redid the whole motor. They just stayed with the block and the cylinder heads. They even changed the valves on the cylinder heads. So. It's definitely making a lot of power now, and this is probably one of the fastest cars on NPK right now, for sure. So, let's see what happens.